More post-game coverage in just a bit, but first a quick look at today's headlines. A large brawl at a high school in Delaware County. School leaders say it all began with a change in the school dress code. Don Timoney explains. Tonight at Academy Park High School in Sharon Hill, an emergency school board meeting after a peaceful student protest about a ban on hoodies turned into an all-out brawl with at least 10 students being arrested. It's a hoodie. It's a piece of cloth. Stop worrying about what's on my body. What's worrying what's in my head. Irate parents, frustrated students and teachers packing the Academy Park High School Auditorium to voice their concerns over a ban on hoodies that went into effect on Monday and the subsequent violence that occurred on Tuesday at school. Yesterday, there was a riot. If you were here, you're traumatized. If you were a kid that was here, I can't even imagine someone could have got killed yesterday. And we need to focus on that instead of focusing about hoodies. Videos posted to various social media show the chaos both inside and outside the high school. Students admitting the situation got out of hand after they protested peacefully, but say they were scared and mistreated. I have pictures and videos of students being treated like prisoners and dogs. All I see is and kids running for their lives. The school board president says the students' behavior didn't solve anything. That you did not approve of it. Tearing, trying to tear down your school, having all of the riots and everything where the police had to be called in and, and everything was not necessary. Many say the real problem has to do with huge staffing shortages, citing 10 classrooms that still don't have teachers. Until we have enough teachers, until we have enough staff to safely patrol the hallways, we shouldn't be even considering worrying about what the kids are wearing. I don't care if they come in their pajamas, at least they're here. After almost four hours of the board getting quite an earful, members voted to rescind the ban on hoodies, although students may not have their hoods up while in the building. Classes are virtual once again tomorrow. No decision has been made yet for Friday or the beginning of next week. Dawn Timoney, Fox 29 News.